U.S. Secretary of State John Kerry met with acting Palestinian Authority Chief Mahmoud Abbas in Istanbul on Sunday. The meeting, however, was behind closed doors, not allowing access to any cameras or reporters. Shortly after the meeting, John Kerry gave a solo press conference. President Abbas made it very clear that he understands uh, the international community's uh, concern and, and focus on the issues that I articulated earlier about accountability, transparency. Uh, Prime Minister Erdogan is coming to visit Washington uh, in May, in the middle of May. Uh, that will be an important uh, next step in this. Kerry also used the press conference to call for full resumption of relations between Turkey and Israel, saying Ankara and Tel Aviv were of strategic importance when it comes to what he described as Iran's threat. We have great mutual interests, Turkey, the United States, and, and Israel in that security arrangements. As a NATO country, Turkey is an important contributor to peace in the region. And one of the reasons uh, that we have a patriot battery on the border here in Turkey is because of that relationship. So clearly, if allies who have differences have suddenly put those differences aside, you have a much stronger alliance. And ultimately, to stand up to threats that are mutual. And one of those mutual threats is Iran. Meanwhile, in order for relations to resume between Israel and Turkey, the family members of nine Turks that were murdered by Israeli Navy forces in 2010 need to accept a compensation from Israel. But they said that will not happen without the lifting of Israel's blockade on Gaza. These families lost their loved ones who were en route to Gaza carrying humanitarian aid. They were murdered. No amount of money will ever be able to get them back to their families. Meanwhile, an Israeli delegation is expected to arrive in Ankara on Monday for further negotiations. U.S. Secretary of State John Kerry on the last leg of his visit called for greater cooperation between Turkey and Israel. This comes as recent reports indicate Israel is trying to set up a military base inside Turkey, a move analysts claim will not sit well with Turkish citizens, nor the Turkish opposition. Turkish opposition CHP members call on Turkish nationals not to let this happen. Serena Shim, Press TV, Istanbul.